do Blastoise rules here. So I made a purchase on Eva. Um, I bought five old school Wizards of the Coast Japanese booster packs. I received the first two in the mail. He sent them in separate envelopes for some reason. So I'm going to open these up in this video. A Gym Heroes and a Gym Challenge. Um, but I, I bought these from... Hopefully I'm not butchering his name. Surge... Two, Surge something. 2012 or something. Surge 7th, 2012 or something like that. Um, I've actually bought off him before. He's a Poketuber also. And he actually does PSA cards also, which is actually really cool. Um, but I'm going to open up these first two packs for you today. It's nice to open up some Japanese um, Wizards of the Coast again. But for all five packs, I paid 5 to 5 50 per pack and they were shipped. Um, the other three I'm getting are a Japanese Fossil, a Japanese Team Rocket, and a Japanese Neo 2 Discovery. But we'll start with this Gym Heroes. If you want to look at the pack art. I was actually almost tempted to keep these sealed, but um, I'll probably end up getting more of these in the future sometime, so... That can wait. I mean, I'd like to open something. It's been a while. So, the first card is the hollow. Ooh, it's actually damaged. That sucks. So, I'm going to take the hollow and place it in a sleeve right away. And then the next card is the rare. So I'm gonna put that down next to it. And then we can go through this. But um, there's, if they're damaged, there's a ding on uh, at least the first few in the bag, which sucks. Um, maybe I can pull one of those white star cards. But we have a Misty's Poliwhirl. A Erica's Gloom. A Erica's Dratini. Brock's Onyx. Brock's Geodude. Really trying to admire these cards. It's been a long time since I've opened this. A Misty's Goldeen. A Loot Surge's Voltorb. And a Brox Zubat. So next on to the rare. We've got a Misty Rare. Not how long. I always liked this Misty card, especially the hollow version in English. It just looks really, really cool. But it's cool to pull this. I think it looks cool with the, the badge in the background and the color. The blue for the water. And my hollow. Is a Erica's Vile one. Looks minty fresh to me besides a couple tiny scratches. And the centering is actually pretty perfect on that card.
Next, we got this gym challenge pack. Or gym 2 in Japanese. And right here it says 291. I think that's Japanese yen. That's equivalent to about $3 US. So, when were packs ever 3 bucks in English? I don't remember that. But Japanese were. And I actually think Japanese still are. Because the actual Japanese booster boxes are only like 25 30 bucks to buy in Japan for the newer sets. This doesn't want to cut. Alright, so... Yeah, there's a few scratches. That sucks. These are damaged, which doesn't make me very happy. He uh, just shipped them in a plain envelope. Which isn't great at all. No padding. So, I mean, there's like scratches on the cards. The cards have been pressed together. Which isn't cool. We have a Blaine's Ponyta. Minion of Team Rocket. A Blaine's Mankey. I don't think Blaine ever had a Mankey. Not that I remember, but... Cool. A, um... Brock's right on. Or Blaine's right on. I like the color of it. It's blue. It's pretty sweet. It's like crystal. A, um... Koga's Golbat. Cool looking card. Koga's Tangela. A Sabrina Slopo. And a Fogus Coffin. And then we get to my non hollow rare. And we've got cool Kogus Pidgeotto. I had this, but mine wasn't mint or near mint, so the near mint copy is nice to have. really like Pidgeotto as a Pokemon. And I also like how they give a non hollow rare along with a hollow too, which is really sweet. Come on, hollow. And my hollow. Yes! We got a Rockets Mewtwo. This is actually really awesome. The only bad news is it would probably grade a near mint to mint 8. There's a few scratches on the back because they came damaged out of the pack. This card's incredible. And if I remember correctly, this is not one of the cheaper hollows and I actually needed this. So, very happy that I bought these and opened these, to tell you the truth. And if you notice, it's got three attacks. I think this is one of the first Pokemon to do this. I'm also thinking maybe the Rocket Zapdos had it too, I think, out of this set. But that's incredible. The Rocket's Mewtwo Hala. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm very happy with this opening. Sadly, the cards are only near mint and not mint, though. Because they were slightly damaged out of the pack, but, um... Uh, Oh well.
I'll be getting the other three packs in shortly. Hopefully, I pull something great out of those, too. Out of the, uh, the fossil, I'm really hoping to pull one of them that I haven't pulled yet, like Dragonite, Mew, or, uh, I might even be missing, like, Ditto or something. And, uh, the Legendary Birds, obviously, too. So stay tuned for that, and thanks for watching. Please thumbs up for either the opening or my sexy Charizards in the background. And thumbs up. Bye, guys.